Welcome to Pika Sim Challenge number two. This week's objective is to fly the Banana F3F model 10 laps between two gates along a cliff face. Now, this is way more fun than the previous Notos DLG challenge. Um, so let's get let's get into the setup. Uh, so from the controller menu, I go to Advanced and I tone down the um, the rates on the the roll rate uh, to make it less sensitive at high speed. And uh, then from the aeroplane menu, I uh, move the uh, the ballast around about 60%. That's uh, that's a good starting point. And the the, the CG with the ballast, I move it just uh, slightly forward. So flying tips. Uh, so use the minus key on the keyboard to fully zoom out. Uh, you need to keep uh, inputs to a minimum. Don't yank and bank. Um, make, make sure you keep your speed up. Uh, stay low to the cliff and traverse the edge. Uh, but try and keep the turns elliptical with a slight, slightly off axis to help keep the speed. Always turn away from the cliff face. Uh, finally, you need to anticipate the turns. Don't wait for the gate beat before you make the turn. So the first gate is on the left hand side. You, um, you get 30 seconds before the timer starts, so you need to use this time to build up your speed. Oh, sketchy. That was close. Yeah, a little bit high there. Oh, that's better. Oh, that's perfect. A little bit far off the edge there. That's better. Yeah, nice. So you can see that run was pretty good, um, but it wasn't perfect, so I reckon 50 seconds is certainly achievable. So next week's challenge is the Weasel Limbo, uh, which is probably my favourite challenge, so uh, see you then.